Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Foot Doctor. In this video, you meet my patient who has developed a deep-seated corn from bunion rubbing against her second toe. Since this was caused by the rubbing of the bunion, the bone has to be surgically fixed before she improves her condition. So let's see how deep this corn is. This, you got deep-seated corn. I know I can burn this and get it better, but the problem is, it's the mechanical problem. It's the bunion that's yeah. making these two toes together. And that's what's rubbing. So unless mm -hmm. that's fixed, it's gonna constantly come back. Mm -hmm. So I was telling her that she needs surgery, unfortunately, to fix this problem more permanently. So I'm just gonna help her feel better for a while, but it's gonna come right back. Yeah, my, my bunion, I don't think Medicare covers the bunion, so. Yeah, yeah, they cover. It, it does? Yeah, yeah, they yeah, really? pay for everything, yeah. Oh, pay for surgery and everything else. That's not the problem. It's the you have to stay down for a couple of months and everything. You know, well, you have to take it easy because we may have to fix this one too. Uh, if this bone is really big, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So overall, you're gonna you're gonna be about two months of taking it easy. You know. Two months. I can't walk, huh? <laughs> you can walk, but you you cannot do too much. First two weeks, you really need to stay down, uh, and then after that, you can get around, but you don't want to be. What about the exercise? Can yeah, you can't do exercise for, yeah, for two months because you could do some sitting down exercises, mm -hmm. but you cannot do any impact or yeah. anything like, like really heavy exercise because we want to heal this properly because bone has to be moved, you know, yeah. and then, so you can see that this one has a corn core inside. Yeah. We can burn it, but it's going to come right back because it's, it's the bone rubbing against the bone, so. You okay? Yeah. So this is going to feel good for a while, so we can keep doing it until you decide to have it fixed permanently, you know? Yeah, I like to, you know, get, you learn whatever you, you know, yeah, yeah. You uh -oh. can do. Hi, it's me again. Hope you've been enjoying this video so far. If you have, leave the word bunion corn in the comments below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Yeah, I'll burn it today for you, so it's going to be yeah, good, good for a while, but eventually, most likely, you're going to have to get it fixed. You can see the round circle in, inside, that's the corn mm. that will just burn today. You see this round circle? Oh, yeah. That's the corn, you know? Because all that rubbing, it causes yeah. the hard little rock to form there. That's what's painful, because it feels like a little rock sitting inside. That's uh, it was, you know, better, but since I uh, started using those uh, liquid for the Oh, corn, the corns and everything? Yeah. 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 Well, because you're body it starts burning and your body wants to protect itself mm -hmm. so it builds up even more yeah. so that you know unfortunately that's not really taking care of the cause of the problem so unfortunately it can kind of get worse so this is going to feel good i'm going to give you a little medicine to burn it and then you're going to tape it up and then we can do it periodically to make it comfortable yeah and then we can fix it whenever how long it takes that heal, you know? For the burning? Uh, for the, uh -huh. Yeah, just a couple of days. You have to kind of take it easy on it. So the, uh, that uh, after a couple of days, I can do exercise? Yes, yes. You can do exercise. Oh, okay. You're going to feel great. You know? So when I do this burning, it won't hurt. Mm -hmm. So. It hurts? No, it doesn't oh, hurt. Okay. I won't feel a thing. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. You're gonna feel good for a while, but it's gonna come back. So as long as you know that, okay. You can see it's got a little like round circle inside, and that needs to be burnt. Okay. Yeah, this is a pretty big circle you can see in the middle of it. Okay, Nina. Okay. All right. Thank you for allowing us to film you today. Thank you for watching this video. As you can see in this video, sometimes the bunion rubbing against the second toe can cause a deep-seated corn. Unfortunately, this requires surgery because it is the bone that's causing the problem in the first place. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others.